Hello, we're thinking here, back with another episode of Crusader Kings 3. We're going to start a new series with Drama Dora. She's 27, Countess of Dora. She is the Hossa culture and the Bori faith. Uh, she is the last Magajia of Dora. Dora Rama is a symbol of the old ways of the Hossa people. Her new husband, Bayajira, originally from Iraq, represents change, as more and more outsiders flock to Hossa land, bringing their strange faiths and cultures with them. Dorama is set to go down in the history as the last Magajia, but does she have to be? Ho ho ho! I thought we'd try something different. I always play in Europe when I played Crusader Kings. Like, always. I, I don't know why. I would either play in the British Isles or somewhere in the Bavarian area here. I didn't, or I guess a couple times I played Scandinavian. I never really tried uh, any of the uh, the other uh, Middle East nations or, or anything. So now that we have a lot of different options in Crusader Kings 3, I think I'm going to try out some of these African nations like uh, the Countess of Dora. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna we're gonna do this and uh, see how it comes out. There will be some timestamps in the description below if you want to skip through all of the introductory stuff. Just click on the chapter and it will take you straight there. All right, you come in, paused. You want to do a few things before you unpause the game, or at least I do. First, I want to find out where the heck am I. So here I am in Dora. All right, so it's down in Central Africa there. I've um, got a lot of desert above us here, as you can see. So uh, probably a lot of uh, terrain in these territories that probably are not very welcoming as well. Even though it's not technically part of the desert, I'm sure these savanna lands probably have some low development as well. So whenever we're doing wars and things, we'll have to be careful of where we send our armies so that we don't end up uh, with a lot of attrition. Um, the, the year is 867, and let's take a look first at our house, House Dora. Um, House of the Dora Dynasty, the gods trust me. All right, we have two living members in this house, four altogether. Wow, that's something. We are obscure at the moment. So we have us and our half-sister, who is also our heir. Interesting. Wow. And it looks like it is matrilineal, because we have our mother here, but not a father. Okay, awesome. Girl power. Nice. <laughs> Love it. Okay, so and then we're going to look at the Bori um, faith here. Esotericism. Children with the learning education focus may gain the wise man trait if they do well with their studies. Wise woman, mystic, and miracle worker are virtues. Uh get extra piety. Addercism enables to seek aid from the spirit's decision. Ooh. Makes the following traits virtues possessed. And then you get extra bory opinion and piety. Oh, interesting. Ritual celebrations. Uh, got uh, feasts. Vassals are more likely to attend your feasts. Okay. All right, cool. So these are all the virtues. Brave, honest, humble. Possessed, wise woman. These are sins. Craven, deceitful, and arrogant. Uh, the main doctrines, they are equal under the law. Uh, that's awesome. Pluralists. All right, so adherents of other faiths have uh, opinion penalties of 50%. All right. Uh, they are theocratic. Okay. Awesome. You have consorts and concubines. Divorce is allowed. Uh, Same-sex relations are accepted. Okay, awesome. Okay, and then we're going to look at the Hossa culture. And it's pretty low at the moment in innovations. It does have crop rotation, casus belly, and plenary, uh, plenary assemblies. And horsemen. It does not have feudalism, right? I mean, it's not, that's, it's not a culture thing. That's a country thing, I guess. Uh, but we are tribal, not feudalist. So, where am I? There's Kong, okay. Here's, I always notice Kong. 
in relation to me. Okay, so now let's take a look at, at the High Chief, Chiefess Dorama. She's 25. She's just honest, trusting, charismatic negotiator, mystic, and diplomat. She's got pretty good skills in diplomacy. Decent in martial and stewardship. Disgusting in intrigue. Holy cow, that's terrible. <laughs> She's got good learning, and her prowess is poor as well. We do hold two domains currently, and we can raise 880 levies out of that domain. I do have one son, Bawa Daraba, Drabawa, excuse me, uh, from our spouse, the High Chieftain uh, of Kano. So he is not in our court. He is in his own nation of Kano down here, which I assume we have an alliance with. Yes, we do, through marriage. Okay, and he is... Our son is his primary heir, but not mine. My heir is my half-sister. Interesting. Okay. So, let's take a look at the kingdom. I mean, the empire map. So, this potentially is a long-term goal for us to, to uh, reunite this kingdom of Kanambordu. Uh, Hasaland is a kingdom in and of itself. So all of these provinces here could potentially become our kingdom, which is probably what I'm going to shoot for in a medium-term goal. Short-term goal, I would like to get uh, at least a duchy title put together. So we're going to go for Gobir first, I think, as part of Hasseland. We'll go for Gobir, which will be these two territories, and then we'll try to gobble up these as well, if we can. All right, very good. All right, we have two domains, one in Dora and one in uh, Katsina. Dora is our uh, capital, and it is uh, uh, in a lot better condition than, than this one. So, uh, the development is still only seven, which is pretty low. So, I think we will get started with looking at our council and uh, see if we can get that working towards a little bit higher development here. There we go. Let's do that. And then let's look at our spy master. It's our sister. She's got a, an intrigue of 10, which is average, which is way better than mine. All right, so that's okay. I think we're good on the council for now. Uh, let's look at our primary heirs of the wrong dynasty. Yes, our son. It belongs to our husband's dynasty. Now let's look at our lifestyle. She has the diplomacy education, so I guess we'll stick with that. We will give her an even better foreign affair focus or... Let's go majesty focus. Get some extra prestige and diplomacy. Alright, so we've got benevolent intent, firm hand, and praetorian guard. All right, so I think I'm going to go probably uh, the diplomat tree once we get going there. My heir is unmarried. All right, so she needs a husband. Very good. Let's look at some alliance powers here. I would like them to be of the Bori faith. Yeah, he's, he's the direct in line heir of of this place. I've got a little bit f further to walk if they have to come and help us. <clears throat> uh, and, uh, hold on. He's got a little bit further to walk, and, but he is the, uh, he has a claim on that, on that thing, so when his father dies, might be a good holy cow he's terrible look at this zeros except for intrigue <laughs> jeez well I guess that doesn't really matter I'm gonna I think I'm gonna go with this one all right and then finally we got some issues we can fabricate a claim uh, I did this arranged marriage I can take a consort all right so how, what do I have right now? I've got no consorts. So I can take a consort. Um, I've got my marshal and champion. He's actually pretty good to have children with, I think. So I think we'll do that. 
All right, let's uh, let's unpause it. <laughs> Took Muhammad as my man. Let's unpause it and get started. All right, let's look at Go Beer here. Forming our alliances. Yep. Go Beer's only got 370 people. Do I have a claim on them already? Yes, I can conquer conquer that county with a uh, war of faith, which I think I will do. Okay, what is in a name? For generations, Hustleland has been ruled by the Magagia, a line of matriarchal rulers of which I am the latest. Our traditions have served us well, but the world is changing. The heroic deeds of my husband, Bayajita, have earned him great wealth and respect, though he hails from distant lands. His successes also portend great change for my people. My son, Bawo, is the apple of my father's eye, or his father's eye. Though a mere babe, I wonder if he will identify more with his father or my own traditional legacy. All right, he will become my heir if I choose this first one. He becomes part of the house Dora. My son is my son, whatever his name or culture. Okay. The Magaji, the Magajia do not need men to carry on their legacy. Oh, ho, ho, ho. I get the law of female preference. He becomes how he becomes part of the house Dora. He gains the trait disinherited, and my sister will remain my heir. I'm gonna do this just to do something different. We're going to do this last one. We're going to carry on the female preference. All right. And in addition to all of that, we are going to call up our troops to declare war on Gobir. Gobir probably is not very wealthy. Uh, already? My God. Slave raiders from the Sahel are unfortunately a threat to many people in this land face. The lure of riches traded for shipping their fellow humans to the ends of the earth is, for some, simply too strong. Usually such raids are scattered and joined, but slavers from Gobir have started making concerted attacks against the Dora. Oh. Interesting. Two arms against these scum. Martial challenge against Sarkin Gadi Garan Galas. I have a 57% chance of doing that. They should really pay tax on this. I gained stress because I'm just. I couldn't care less. Uh, let's go against. Let's go arms against these scum. All right. Uh, you defeat and loot the slavers. Nice. Sweet. Now I'm declare war I'm for that. Just for that, we're going to war. Yeah. You ain't sending no slavers to us. You shall pay with your lives. I don't think we need any of our allies for this battle. He's got a lot fewer troops than we do, so we're just going to ride in, crush him. All right, so this is my man, right? Mahmoud, yep. It's my consort. Nice. And we win already. We took prisoner of the leader there, so. All right. May your years be short and miserable. I hope not. Okay. Uh, gain some fame and again go beers. And now we have three provinces. I'm going to go ahead and disband our troops. All right. Awesome. Oh, well, that was easy. That was easy. Low county control. All right. So let's go to our council. Let's get our marshal over here to control go beer a little bit. Get that up. We are still developing in Dora. Let's look at go beers yeah we got one development i figured that would be the case so not exactly the richest land here but that's okay we're uh just make a little bit uh a little bit of progress at a time let's go to the court and see our prisoners we've got shawata in house arrest my prisoner what is she in prison for i don't know i can get a hook on her who is she i don't know i'll release her look for a hook Good. I also want to go ahead and hire a physician. So let's start a search for a physician. Uh, here's some of the decisions we can do. Call a hunt, feast, pilgrimage, seek aid of the spirits, a mystical communi uh, communion, interesting, or invite champions. Oh, okay. Court physician. Let's see what we got here. Got Masood uh, or Kamran. Let's take a look. They're both Islamic. I'm gonna I'm gonna pass on both of them. I don't want 
the Islams to be uh, predominant in our court. I want to try to keep it all boring if I can. Um, just for uh, to grow our faith. So I want to say they do not oppress me at this time. All right, let's take a look at Tahua. They've got a thousand twelve. Okay, their strength is inferior to ours. Uh, should I go ahead and hire a, a man at arms? Got some Sahel horsemen. Costs prestige. Interesting. Instead of money, I like that. I remember it saying something about we have a spe this special unit here, so I'm gonna go ahead and get this. It is expensive, but I think it will help us in the long run. All right, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna let that start to gather up. I know we don't have a lot of money right now, but I wanted to go ahead and get that going. I'm gonna go ahead and let just a couple of months go by, and then we're gonna declare war on Tahua. I think we can already, no problem. Yes, we can. Let's just go ahead and do it. I mean, why wait, right? They are inferior to us. He does have one ally of Kebby. 824. I am now the culture head. Nice. Good. I've got two allies. Are they in wars anywhere? Uh, he's raiding. He's raiding. Alright, we're going to go ahead and declare war. I'm going to raise all my armies and I'm going to call my allies to war as well. Both of them. Whew, I'm out of prestige now, though. All right. Yep. Bring it. Bring me your armies. Yeah, here they come. Here comes my husband. They were raiders. Enemy ally joined. Okay. All right, he's coming to. I wish my ally would come up here. I hate working with allies, man. They're the worst. All right, let's attack. Yeah, he's coming with me. So, hopefully, we can pull this off. All right, here we go. We're attacking. We wounded one of his champions. Wounded another, another one. Uh oh. My champion got wounded. Oh no. Runs deep. Oh no, it's my air too. That's unfortunate. And I don't have a doctor. Okay, we won. Awesome. Let's go over here. Let's see if we can just take this and get this war over with here. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and go in here and see if I can... Uh, I can't search for a physician, can I? Let's look at who we got in our court here and see if we can just make them our physician. Got Yassi Boy here. Um, he's an insightful thinker. He does have good learning, so he could probably learn to be a doctor. I don't know if it's going to be in time. I'm going to do it. I'm going to hire him to the court. Three to hire him. That's not, that's fine. And then make him my physician. It's going to be cost me ten. That's fine. Okay. Now my physician might be able to treat our sister, I hope. A child is growing in my womb. Nice. I hope it's a girl. Okay. Got our allies here. They're real dancing around. Hopefully he doesn't capture someone of import. Well, this is my court here, so he's, he's doing a different... All right, we got it. Okay, let's go. Let's move on down here. Come on, allies. Get in there. Alright, we're in there. Our champion was slain. Oh no! Flaw of character. Once I have departed this world, my sister Shawata shall rule in my stead. Unfortunately, rumors of Shawata's utter cowardice have been spreading around my court. It makes me wonder if she can handle the responsibilities of Dara and the people once I am gone. Attempt to rectify her flaws. Talk up her good qualities. Or focus on myself and lead by example. Let's try to rectify her, her flaws. She's agreed to let me be her mentor, even though her enthusiasm is somewhat lacking. I fear her vices are deeply set, but a truly eye-opening experience might make her realize the folly of her ways. Venture into the streets and talk to the poor. 
Open up to a misdeed and make it right again. Or own up to a misdeed. Give away possessions to those in need. Hold the court in my stead. What are her traits? She's sadistic and lustful. So she should probably uh, talk to the poor. Or give away possessions to those in need. Well, she's not greedy. She just sadistic. She likes people in pain. <laughs> I went up to a misdeed and make it right again. How about that? There you go. You're wrecked. Get wrecked. Sira, a commoner, and two others were slain. I'm delighted to see the changes in Shawata. While well, at first she did not think she'd been in the wrong, the response she received when rectifying the matter got through to her. All right, cool. Great achievement. She loses sadistic and gains compassion instead and also gains stress. We must work harder. Okay. I'll gain a little bit of stress. That's fine. Yeah, I'll let my allies chase off the... Uh, my sons. Oh, did I have twins? Wow. Two perfect little boys. Let's name one of them after Mahud. And the other one after a good Hassan name. Duru. I like that. All right. I got some prestige from that. Okay, so let's go on over here and I guess what? Attack one of the, the allies? I mean, what can I even do except for that? I've, I've already taken all the land and defeated his armies twice. Uh, I need to reassign a, a new uh, champion here. Uh, I, I could put myself in charge. I'll, I will. I'll put myself in charge. So I don't think I'll be fighting per se. Alright, let's go to the marshal. What? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Did my man die? Hold on. Hold on. Uh, we need a new marshal. Let's go ahead and recruit this guy. He's good. Okay. And assign him. Okay. Let's look at ourselves. Let's see if, uh... Let's see where our man is here. Did he die? Yes, I guess he did. Mama died. Because he is no longer... Around. Yep, there he is. He died in battle. Yes. Well, isn't that crappy? Let's find a new consort. My new marshal is going to be my new consort. He's Bori, so that's good. And he's Hassa. That's awesome. Yep, taking my consort. All right, let's look at it. Get another one, maybe my other champion. Uh, he's pretty good. These actually are all pretty good. This guy's a little bit older. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and get all three. Why not, right? Okay. Now we're married. Alright, we have lots of consorts and one husband. Okay. Very good. After we take this uh allies capital, we should we should have this in the bag. I mean my god. We've got twenty five percent from battles one, we've got war score from occupied holdings, and we've got our held objectives, but that's still not enough, apparently. Still not enough. So now we have to take over the Allies capital, and I think it's just because they have such a massive amount of troops left that. Uh... Ooh, I got a new diplomacy perk. Good. I'm gonna take thoughtful. I already know. That gives me uh, opinion boost from a gift, which I don't really care about, but I do care about these others below it. So that's what I'm going for. If he starts coming up after me, I'm gonna have to bail. Unless my allies get over here. Nope, he's going back after my territory. Go get him, boys. He's going after Go Beer. You know, this war has turned out a little bit longer than I thought it would. I kind of thought it'd be a one shot deal, kind of like Go Beer was, but you no, know, not so much. All right. Seriously, that's still not enough to take. Oh my god. All right, here we go. I hope I don't die in this battle. You got a disadvantage, which is not good. Oh, look at this. He's a freaking awesome warrior. 31. Wow. Our champion was wounded. Any combatants, enemy combatants uh, captured. Awesome. A lot of them. Alright, so let's just chase these mothers down. My god. I'm sick of them. We're, our war score is slowly ticking up, so... We should be able to win here just shortly. 
All right, we got it. We got it. Awesome. Now, wisdom and mercy are legendary. Ho <laughs> ho! Now we've got all of our domains that form up uh, Dora, right? Yeah. Cool. So, I'm gonna disband all my troops for now. Bink. Uh oh, deadly encounter. I'm visiting one of the small rivers close to the chiefdom of Dora. As I'm about to quench my thirst, a local man resolutely positions himself between me and the river. The nerve. Just as I'm about to order him removed, he speaks up. There's a crocodile in the water, my lady. He was protecting me? Thank you. Here for your village. A county investment for five years. That's not bad. I could use him in my court. A crocodile. Pfft, I saw no crocodile. <laughs> Drink water for one year small boost of health let's see what's he got here he's a thrifty clerk all right got some pretty good stats he is bory development growth five plus five percent per month and popular opinion plus five I kind of want that really to tell you the truth I'm gonna do that here's for your village thank you for your assistance okay awesome so let's take a look at our Council now, we're doing good. Let's look at ourselves. We probably have to uh, do something with our children here. So I am going to No, I don't want to I don't want a marriage for him. I want to educate the child. And it's gonna be me. It's gonna become my ward. Yep. And the other child will be me as well. Alright. And then our first son. Who is going to educate this child? Uh, don't know. He's disinherited, so. And he's not in our court, so. <laughs> you can have him. <laughs> Low control in counties. Gobir and Tahuna. Alright, so I'm working on our Tahua. Sorry, there's no N in that. Uh, I'm working on that. Uh, we can ransom this guy for 50 gold. Yes, do that. I can create the Duchy of Gobir. All I need is 125 gold. All right, so we're going to save up for that 125 gold. And when I say save up, I mean probably go raiding. Hold on, hold on. Oh, yeah. That was just us uh, ransoming that guy for 50 gold. That's good. Uh, okay. Uh, I can go raiding. Yes, it, it, it's pointing that out. Let's look and see what a good place to raid would be. Let's look at this place. Uh... They have zero loot there. They have 15 loot here. Three loot. 15 loot. Oh yeah, let's, let's, oof. We can get that loot, come back and form our, our duchy. But that's going to be about it for this episode. I think this, uh, the, the claiming of Dora will be the first episode. Uh, next episode, we will go raiding and see if we can form the duchy of Dora. So I hope you have enjoyed it. If you did, smash that like button. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.